Well, Rob, real quick on your screen, tell me the color and the daughter dots on this dice. Five, four, three, two, one. Yellow, three. Yeah. Yes, it is. It's yellow and it's a three. Very good. Whoa. <laughs> Very good. When I catch you off guard, your left brain has no time to shut down the left <laughs> side. Grab one of the symbol cards. Just grab any one at random. Okay, put the others back. Hide it under your keyboard. Uh, under, under. Yep. Okay. Okay. Your mind sight can go there and actually see it. It's not a problem. Your mind sight. Uh, can... I, I guess it saw it before, <laughs> before hiding it. A circle. Okay, try again. So I guess you didn't see it. So now you're going to try to see it. Ah, okay. Okay. Just feel where your keyboard is, Rob. Feel where yeah. it is. Yeah. Touch it with your hands. Ah, okay. Okay, and say, I'm hiding a symbol card under this keyboard. I want to see what it is. I want to see what it is. Okay. Find sight there. This is a challenge. It's hiding under your keyboard. Just pretend that you can pick it up the energy with your hands, with your beams, move your head around. Oh, I can't tell you. I see. I see the up, up, and I don't know if it's a square or if it's belong to the plus. For the moment, it could be one of both. Okay, it is one of those. <laughs> I want you to zero in now, Rob. Move your hands around the keyboard because you need to direct your mind sight. It's under this keyboard. This is where I want to look. It's under my keyboard. I want to zero in specifically on whether it's a plus or a square. Your mind sight can go there and it can get that, Rob. Ah, a plus. Okay, yes it is. So take it out and show it to the screen. Very good, there it is. It's I, I, I check. <laughs> yeah, it is. What I want you to do is grab two symbols at random. Turn them over so you don't see them. Grab two. Send your mind sight to go through the card to the other side and see the symbol. Your mind sight can do this 100%. Have the intention that you can go to the other side of the card and see the symbol. I, I, I already saw, uh, uh, see something, a triangle. Let's take a look. Yes, it is. Now, is it an open triangle or closed? So look through the card, Rob. Mm -hmm. Very good on that, by the way. Look through the card, move your beam around, pretend your beam can go through the card and see what's on the other side, because it can. You've just proven it to yourself. Mm -hmm. Have the intention to see the image on the other side of the card. Mm -hmm. Is it open or closed? Open. Okay, yes it is. Pick up the card and show the screen. Very good, very good on that, Rob. So you just proved to yourself you can see through paper. You've got x-ray eyes, Rob. <laughs> very good. Real quickly, what color cup is in your screen, Rob? Mm. Three, two, one. Blue. Yes, it is, very good, very good. Now quickly, what letter do I have in your screen? Quickly, Rob. Three, two, one. L. Yes, it is. Very <laughs> it's L. You got it. And it's, it's just an example where if you had given me more time, I wouldn't have accepted the L. <laughs> <laughs> but you, you haven't let me the choice. <laughs> I didn't get a, another. <laughs> Once again, I got to catch you off guard. <laughs> and you get it most of the time, Rob. That's the uh, crazy thing about it, right? Fantastic. Oh, uh, I may tell you that uh, the last day since our session, I have got, I could see many, many letters and once three in a row. Excellent. That's <clears> very good, Rob. Well, we know you're moving forward with this.
This is working for you. It absolutely is. So you got the L, and that's, once again, out of 26 letters, you got it correctly on the count of three. Very good. Yeah. Start by tapping the left side of your face with your left hand. Okay, just feel that. And I've got a playing card in your screen. Tell me the color, the suit, and the number quickly. I imagine it was black because the, the word uh, 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 a spade came. Yes, it's a spade. Did you ever see the Eiffel Tower when you were a kid? Uh, on images. So you know what it looks like, right? Yes. Okay, well, just visualize the Eiffel Tower in your mind. You know, you don't have to hold it. You can just flash it in there every few seconds. And while you do that, I'm going to count down to one. And when I hit the one, I want you to tell me the card in your screen. It's a playing card. Three, two, one. Uh, red? Yes. Uh, oh, heart? Yes. You got that it was red and then it was a heart. That was very good, Rob. We need to give you a challenge. You thrive best on a challenge and when we catch you by surprise. I'll be, I take the card and I hide it under my computer and you come to my location in Canada here by remote viewing, which your mind sight can easily do, no problem. In some ways, remote viewing is actually easier than mind sight. It's really all part of the same thing. Come to my computer and tell me the number that's on the card that I'm touching. I'm tracing it out, it's under the computer, my computer is on a stand, it's open underneath, uh -huh. I have a number showing, and I'm tracing it. Just let go and let it appear. Four. Yes it is, and I'm gonna hold it in your screen. There's <laughs> the number, very good. Once again, you can see when I give you a challenge, your mind sight operates better. Yes, for sure. When I catch you off guard, <laughs> hindsight works better. So we know the drill. So Rob, <laughs> if you can pick up some plasticine in your travels over the next few days. I will do that. That's your homework. <laughs> <laughs> and I can tell you you're doing well, very well. There's no doubt in your mind and my mind that you have hindsight. Mm. We know 100%. That you do. This time there were many, many good answers. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Not the least of which was the very last one. When I hit it out of you and put your mind sight to work, it got it. I it have loved it. the L. <laughs> you got the L, yeah, that was one <laughs> out of 26. Yeah, yeah, in the first try. Grab a letter from your Scrabble bag right now. Don't try to know what the letter is. Just grab a random letter. Yes. And show me in the screen. Now turn it to yourself. Quickly tell me what letter is that? V. Yes, it is. Hold it to the screen. <laughs> Very good on that. So we'll end the session uh, with that one. <laughs> I, I like it as, as uh, the L. <laughs> You've got, yeah, the V and the L. Wow, fantastic. <laughs>